If you, like me, have been eagerly awaiting Marvel Studios to give us another update on the upcoming Blade the Vampire Slayer reboot by Marvel Studios, good news, because it looks like we sort of have an idea at the release date. So recently in a Facebook post on his own personal page, one of the co-creators of Blade, Marv Wolfman, was talking about upcoming projects and what he's been doing on his, uh, well, downtime with uh, the whole situation around the planet and things gearing up to happen next. And if we go back through history, we see that Marv, um, he spoiled a few things here or there when it comes to a... Uh, few involvements with Marvel TV and even certain Marvel Studios projects. So as he talks about many upcoming projects, right there towards the end, he talks about what's coming next year, and he says that Blade is coming in 2022. Now, much speculation has been tossed the way of uh, the October 7th, 2022 slot that Disney and Marvel Studios have had. And there's been a lot of discussion that either that's going to be for Deadpool 3 or Blade. With him coming out and saying, well, next year Blade, I think uh, more and more evidence is probably pointing towards that being a Blade release date. Because let's say, for example, if they start shooting this October, this is Blade. Marvel Studios can get a Avengers film out in 14 months. And I mean from shooting to getting all the visual effects done. I'm pretty uh, confident in saying that Blade the Vampire Hunter or the Vampire Slayer is uh, not going to require as many special effects as a Avengers film and that the uh, production time on it and the post-production is going to be much shorter and it's going to be much faster. So even if they were to start, let's say, in January of next year, you could still get the film out by October. It's really not that hard for them. Now, there is always the possibility of things getting shifted, and this is just the current plan, because, I mean, let's look at it realistically around the planet. Things could get delayed again. Productions might have to shift. Productions might run over their time and borrow time or sets and whatever they're planning from, uh, you know, some of the other productions because of constant changes that are being made due to the status of the world. So maybe they start a little bit later. But again, I don't think there's anything here. If they were to bump it into 2023, there's plenty of release dates. There's still four Marvel Studios release dates for that year, which could realistically be a... Uh, good idea if they do fall behind but october it just seems like a perfect place to put out a vampire film specifically next year when most theaters are going to be reopened and people are going to want a marvel fix in october because we've seen it work before we've seen it work with the likes of venom and on the dc side we've seen it work with joker so marvel studios capitalizing on that date with a darker film makes sense 